two more set boosters. We're going to actually do two more set boosters after this as well. How's everybody doing? We have Magic the Gathering cards to open. And we have a freaking lot of them. The Wizards logo has changed a lot over the years. Not the, not the logo itself. I mean, yeah, the logo itself, but the wrapping logo. That's different. Uh, I don't even recall seeing a logo like that before. Maybe I haven't been paying that close of attention, but have you guys noticed that? The logo on the shrink wrap is a little different. Anyway, I'm opening both of these at the same time because I want to make a really freaking sweet little thumbnail here with a whole a lot of packs out and uh, a little different from, you know, the regular booster. So if you want to fast forward, probably, I'd say two minutes in is where we're going to start cracking. By all means, go ahead. Other than that, you can listen to my sweet little voice as I just ramble freaking on, baby. Wow, that's right. How many packs can we get? Up? Look, 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 look at all this. Look at all, look at all this chaos. That's a, that's a, that's a, that's a lot of stuff. Does that make it look more festive? Did you click on this thumbnail because of that? No? Okay. Let's get into cracking. All right, so we're like a minute in. Not too bad. We're like a minute in. Minute and 20 some seconds. Oosh. Let's go. Okay, here we go. Oh my goodness. Someone's like, did, when is someone going to point out to Joey that there's a pool tab on those? Mm, I'm sorry, buddy, but I didn't even want to bother replying to you in the comment section. But I thought I would tell you right freaking meow. It depends where it's made. This one clearly was not made in Japan, so there's no pool tab. Now you know. Oh, there we go. We got ourselves the old ogre. And like the way. This is going to be like a zippity doodah because you guys have already seen. Let me crack open two of these already. So we're looking for the big hits. And we're looking, that's what we're looking for. Big freaking hits. There's a lot of stuff we can gawk at, but we've already done that. Ha ha, damn, bro. Uh, whoo, doggy. We got ourselves Thousand Face Shadow. Oh, we're starting off really good. What's that? Oh, Ayo, the Dawn Sky. You seldom will see these cards pulled. An extended art foil mythic in a set booster. That's my experience, at least. Does not happen very often. That is breathtaking. Holy freaking hell. There we go. We should... Boots and pens and boots and pens and boots and pens. All right, guys, ready? All right, here we go. I'm still going at it. So who has cracked open set booster packs? Uh, wait, that's are we asking too early? Who is ready to crack open booster packs? And uh, my other question is, why are we screwing up the piles really bad? There we go, that goes there. Um, yeah, okay, there we go, much better. <laughs> what are you going to be... Whoa, that's a lot of black right there. Uh, what are you going to be opening up? Ruthless Technomancer showing on up. Along, ooh, I've got a triple rare pack possibly. The old Soul, Soul Ripper. Oh, almost, almost. And the Infiltrator, okay. Thought we were into something crazy there. I wonder how many Mythics we're going to get in these uh, 60 packs. We have 60 freaking packs to crack, Jack. 60 beautiful packs. Let's bring that camera up a little bit, shall we? There we go. Now you guys get a nice good view of all the crazy madness that goes on here. See? I did price out one of these boxes. Oh, it was a draft booster box. If you want to go back and check that video out, just go back one video. It's sitting right there waiting for you, pal. But other than that, yeah. Uh, again, the prices are going to drop. I mean, it's just kind of common, you know. You're not learning nothing new watching this video. I highly freaking doubt it. Uh, other than my IQ is probably like 14, you know. But I myself am 19. That's right. I know. All right, here we go. Reinforced. I go. Weaver of Harmony. Man, we started out so strong. Roadside Relic Wearing. No, we started out really freaking strong. Like, you can't even start out that strong. I'm going to actually raise this camera up a bit because it's messing with my back. Like, I kind of, like, hunch over. So, here we go. One, two, and a three. All the way to the top level, pal. Well, it could go higher than that, but for right freaking meow. That's where, oh, you see the bell? Isn't that sick? Look, some behind-the-scenes action right there. Put the bell over here. All right, so, man, that Ayo, the Dawn Sky. Ayo, if you pull him, you have to say that. You got to say Ayo. All right. Ooh, that is beautiful. It's like probably going to maintain at least a $2 price point. It all depends, though. I mean, the, the market's going to be flooded once uh, collector boxes hit, and then the price of always foils is tank. But as for right now, they're looking pretty freaking hot, man. We got ourselves a Commander Boy. Ooh, 
The Okiba Reckoner. Mm -hmm. All right, fair enough. Let's go, guys. Are you ready? We just put on our speed hat. We're like, all right, we're going to get speedy with it. Shrink. Everyone's like, Joey, I know what that means. Hey, I don't mess around with that stuff no more, guys. Come on now. Here we go. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, I saw Tamio. There are some, there is one, uh, only one common valued over a dollar. Oh, there we go. Floodhound showing on up. That's our first list card. Very impressive, I know. Everyone's like, man, I was at the local game store the other day, Joey. You wouldn't believe the list pool I just hit, dude. I hit a Floodhound. Cool. March of Swir <laughs> Don't you want to see like some better stuff than that though? We're gonna make one pile. I don't care about lands. We're putting all the lands in one freaking pile. But look at look at this. Look at us. We just got wild there, man. It's wild on E. Remember that containment construct? That's one of the better uncommons you can hit right there, if not the best uncommon. Uh, again, things can change and they will change. We guarantee that. Now this pack, we're gonna pick back up and find out what the heck is in it. <laughs> we have we have a lot of fun. All right, come on, baby. We were looking for that gold. Big Mythic. Ooh, Cryptic Dreams. That is something. And Thousand Phase Shadow. So a double rare pack. Not bad. With Kato's Pursuit. Okay. We'll take a double rare. I'll take a double rare all freaking day. But what I'm looking for are the crazy list hits. And we hit a doubling cube. Spoiler alert if you haven't seen that first video. We hit a freaking doubling cube, man. That's nutty. I can't remember the value on that, but I know it's up there a little bit. There's the dragon, Mr. Kami himself, and Katana. Shrink. Okay. I, I could not believe that. I, I, it's almost as unbelievable as us cracking open a sealed Ice Age booster box. That's actually going to happen. Uh, I'm not messing with you. That's actually going down. Seat of the Empire. Bada bing. And Iron Apprentice. These are nice. I really like the, uh, the land cycle in this set. I think the land cycle in this set is freaking amazing. I, I don't think you can argue that whatsoever, so there you go. Alright, come on, big hit. Tamio is safekeeping. Currently, that's over a buck. How long will that last? It's hard to say, buddy. It's hard to say. Uh, Kami of Transience. 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 There you go. And the old, this guy. Wow! Really? Only one List card so far? Holy crap. I feel like we're down in the dumps. Only one list pool, man. That is wacky. Okay. One list pool. Out of every... Whoa. <sighs> Blade of the Oni. Anyone speculating on a mythic? I need to hear it. What mythic are you speculating on? Because there is one I'm speculating on. Not that card, but there is a mythic. There's a mythic pile. Um, there is a mythic I'm actually speculating on. Uh, which one is it? Uh, the War. Kami War? Yeah, Kami War. Joey's speculating on that card. I'm not saying it's going to be a $30, $40 card, but I do believe it's going to be like a $10 card within the next like month. Nah, maybe, maybe not month. Maybe like within the next two months. All it takes is that card to find some freaking nice little home. Eater of Virtue, bada bing. All it takes is a card to find a little home. And then off it goes into Value Town. But I ended up purchasing, I know I said it in the one video, but I bought 100 bucks worth. Uh, I said screw it. Uh, mostly extended art and showcase. No regular. I know, I like to live dangerously, guys. Uh, but we will see what happens with it all. I could be taking a pound town, but it's one of those like, ha, I told you so, you know, because that's the card I'm specking on. But I got to hear what cards are you specking on in this set, if any. I mean, and sometimes you have to wait for a card to drop in price when a new set arrives because prices are so inflated. But with Kami War, man, it's already pretty low. Oh, this looks so freaking good. I can't get over that, man. That deserves a bell itself. They do look freaking amazing. But, uh, yeah, usually uh, it could take some time for a card to drop in price. But right now, I'm kind of hoping it doesn't drop much lower than what it's at now. That's one of those rarer cards. Um, you don't get too many of those in these, but that is a one of those commander like special cards that were like inserted in one of these big boxes, I believe, if I'm not mistaken. And we got the old trainee. Holy crap! Where are the list cards, bro? We had one box with like 10 or 12 list cards. You remember that? 
And now this box, we've pulled one. I guarantee you pulling right now, though. Cur of the Boundless Sky, about a bang. Another mythic, pretty cool. Uh, that'll probably be a $3 card pretty soon before you know it. Uh, I think it's sitting at about six bucks right now and dropping as I uh, as I speak. <laughs> probably by the time you see this video, because I recorded like my videos like one day in advance now, just in case anything crazy happens in my day, um, you know I'm able to at least have that video and I can prepare for the next day. Like I think if that's the way to go about it, soul transfer is not bad. There we go. Whoa, where are the list cards, man? I mean that could be the title of this video. Um, Wizards screwed up uh, how they distribute. Whoa, holy moon. Moon, 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 moon. The man, you got moon, guys. Holy smothering ties. And the old Jugan defends the temple. Wow. Don't say this one too much. Um, create a 1 1 green human monk creature token with tap, add to green mana. Put a puzzle sky. So I'm going to turn the battlefield. What does it do? Dragon spirit. X when you do, but X probably kind of as long as you. Yeah, this card's really not that great. <laughs> I hate to burst your bubble, fellas, but that card is not that great. Do not spec on that one. That that's probably gonna tank down to about a buck fifty when uh, all the dust uh, settles. Uh, that's not one you want to spec on. Uh, my my humble opinion. Look at this juke guy, juke guy, juke guy. But again, that's what these set boosters do. They uh, give like a little theme, you know. All right, there's the long reach of night march. Of wretched sorrow, followed by tales of master. Ooh, really? <laughs> Sorcerer's one. We'll take that forty-five cents and pocket that all day. Uh, kind of strange seeing that. Not strange seeing it, but strange seeing only a common and uncommon so far in the list slot. Man, a lot of nice foil lands. That's our third foil land, if I'm not mistaken. Third foil land. That's looking great, man. I am expecting a really nasty, massive mythic pool out of all this. I'll let you know right now. It's going to be huge. It's going to be Trump huge. It's going to be huge. It's going to be huge. It's going to be, it's going to be huge. Uh, it's going to be really big. It's going to be really big. It's going to be payday. It's going to be pay dirt, man. But no, it's going to happen when you see it, man. I don't know. Ha <laughs> ha, <laughs> yeah. Ha <laughs> up your ass. There it is, baby. That's one of them. I, I think we're going to get two. Wow. <laughs> Tazeret, Betrayer of Flesh. Our mythics have been really good in this opening. Holy crap. Get a load of stud over here. That is awesome, bros. Okay. Well, that happened right away. Whoa, Shinto's. Okay, yeah. You ever eat at Shinto's? Anyone ever heard? You have your Shinto's by you? I don't know. Back to that dragon? No. Um, great place. I, li I like uh, going to restaurants where they cook in front of you. You know? I don't do it often, but maybe like once or twice a year. Usually it's for a special occasion. Last time I was there, I was for a friend's birthday. Uh, but yeah, it doesn't happen that often. Inventive iteration and Sunblade Samurai. Hey, we just hit something... <laughs> We, we called it. Okay. All right. <laughs> Are you guys ready for a lot of breaks and stuff? A lot of breaks. And uh, I'm talking expensive breaks. I'm talking crazy breaks. I'm in, like, I think more than half of the breaks. We're going to be opening Kamigawa block stuff. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be nuts, man. OG Kamigawa block. Double rare pack. Always welcome. Kunami. Well, I'm seeing wins. It could be wines, no one knows, you know, because English, they spell wind and wind the exact same. Can anyone explain that to me? Like, like why? How, why, you know? There we go. All right, something big. Something big. Oh, the fall of the kind of jing stuck in the shot. <laughs> Cut it out. Oh, man. No, you're not mad. Look at that, baby. Oh, man, the Progress Tyrant, all in the flesh. Oh, that is beautiful. Have yet to hit one of the Phyrexian uh, text cards yet. But you know it's coming, baby. And a foil rare to punt. What about a list card? Oh, my God. What a f***ing pack, dude. Holy crap. When we call them, baby, we call them. Oh, my goodness. Soren Markov. 
List from M12. Beautiful pool. I was just talking shit about the list. A foil rare and freaking tyrant boy over here. Holy monstrous raiders. That was just insanity. Oh my god. Lack of bows, bitches. That was sick, man. Oh shit. All right, we're going to keep this going. Uh, that's it. There's not going to be too many good pulls now after that. But, um, wow. Talk about hitting a massive home run. Nice to see these lands in the back here. Interesting. We got Mr. Thunderboy with Mirror Shell Crab. I hear Jackson. Raven Familiar. No one cares, bro. We just hit a freaking double mythic pack with two big boys. I mean, they are slanging. We just came through. We just showed up in town. Stole your girl. Ran away with her. Nah, no, I was kidding. We gave her back to you at the end of the night. Bada bing, baby. Here we go. Rugged Highlands. Come on. What else is next? What else is next? Come on. Let's get some dirty. Let's get some dirty. Let's get some dirty. <sighs> Another mythic when we're asking for it. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -ba. Pretty cool, man. At the beginning of your end step, go to each creature your opponent's control that's enchanted by an aura you control. Put a pulse on pulse one counter on Kaima. Kaima? The fractured calm for each creature goaded. Ooh, what a pack. What a pack. What a pack. Crucible of Defiance right behind it to punt with the old sling foil. Ooh. This has been a real freaking treat. I, I, I was like a little nervous going into this video. I'm like, I don't know if I'm having anything to talk about, but I can just predict things and make them happen out of thin air. So I'm going to stick to that method. Surge Hacker Mech Boy. Okay. And Samurai. Whew, okay. Last pack for this set booster box. Remember, we have three more booster boxes to go. Only one's going to be in this video, though. Well, two. Two total. Two total. Two total. Tamiya. Was that, was that my girl? What's up, girl? Safe keeping. You know what's up. Touch. Kissed by a rose. There you go. Kamigawa. I don't know why I just thought about that. Oh, the Toad Rider. This dude in his foilness. Don't forget we pulled that also. Uh, Toad Rider foil. That's what? Three or four? Three or four. Holy crap. But let's, let's clear a path here. Clear a path here. Clear a path here. Let's get this over here. Move that puppy along. That's probably why I struggle to find cards ever. Because I just clump all the common on commons together. That probably makes sense. All right. We are on to box two of this magnificent, beautiful looking set. Look at that. Careful, careful. Care crafted, careful. Greater. Greater crafted, crafted, careful. Okay. We won't do that again. All right. We got the modern age. In we keep pulling you, man. Not that impressed. And we got Ember Keeper. Ooh, Storm Entity showing up. That could that could actually be pretty dope. That could be pretty cool. You cast like two spells before or something, you know. Don't get carried away. But you could get carried away. And then you get so carried away. Throw it in a blue deck. Make that sucker unblockable. You know, take your opponent to Pound Town. I could think of some weird little synergy with that. All right. We're still trucking, baby. Don't ask about my piles. Oh, man. Extended our... Oh, my God. Look at this. We got Roaring Blades. Shows up on the doorstep. Front and center. Followed by... Seat of the Empire. Wow. That's pretty. My first extended art land from this set. It feels good. I know. It does feel good. And Soul of Kamigawa, the card I probably pulled more of than any other card. I'll say that. Mnemonic Sphere Foil out to point. That was uh that was cool. I like seeing uh the extended art lands before collector box. It just it, it makes it that much more special, you know? Speaking of collector boxes, we're going to be opening about 20 on the channel. Probably, maybe more. So if you guys want to get a really good idea of what the hell's all up inside of them, this is the channel you want to check out because we do the mass openings when it comes to collector boxes. We don't, we don't pussyfoot, you understand? All right? We just put our foot in, uh, in shoes. So, you know, if, if you like seeing people put their foot and shoes around here, by all means, check it out. Okay, ooh, that looks, that, 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 doesn't that look expensive? That foil? Cool, Lion Sash. Not one of the worst ones. I don't believe, that's, that's cool. We'll take it. Okay, okay. 
Okay. Okay. But it's time we pull a mythic. It's time we pull some freaking real fire, baby. We need a we need a sick ass mythic. Uh, nope, that's not what I thought it was. We need a sick mythic. Let's go. The long, the shattered. March of Swirling Mist. Joey, that's not a mythic. I know. I'm sorry about that. Neither is that acquisition octopus. Whoa. We just got battered and splattered. Can't call them all, I guess, huh? All right. Well, it's coming, though. It's in the next couple packs. I thought it was going to be that pack, though. So I was wrong. I must be a little off today, like every other day. All right. Rain, Core of the Boundless Sky. See, we were close. Very cool. Nice little dragon spirit. Tales of a Master. And, oh, wow <laughs> okay see the, with the list pools man I really think they should just do away with the common cards I, I'm almost teetering on do away with the common and uncommon cards from the list only insert common and uncommon list cards if their value is $2 and up Reduce the number of list cards. That's hot. Haven't seen that one yet. Reduce the number of list cards in each set booster box by 20, 30%. Make them only rare and mythic. That's it. That's it. Do not introduce any foils in the list. For the, for the, for the love of God, Watsy. Do not. Oh, triple rare pack, Jack. Mmm, that felt good. Oh shit, that felt really good. <laughs> Ogre head helm. Man, that art looks sick, bro. Might be like mech warriors and shit, you know? Get a load of that guy. We pulled you, baby. We pulled you. Ooh, that swamp is dope. Very hot swamp. We'll take it in the foil pile. But what do you guys think of that? You think I'm onto something there? I think I'm onto something. No one wants to pull a freaking four cent list card. Especially when they're like, what, average of one in six packs, you get a list card? Is not is that about the going rate? Something like that? On this channel, you've seen like one in three, one in two. Uh, <laughs> but that's not normal. Just just know that was like a blooper. Shouldn't have had that many list cards uh, in the one box that we opened, but we did. We had a freaking heck ton, man. All right, we got ourselves the old Skyward Soaring City. Well, the blue land finally showed up. Pretty freaking dope. And the ambusher. And nothing to put. So our list pools have been dog shit. Uh, we got to do better than dog shit right now. What do you guys think? Can, can we do better than dog crap? We're not going to abuse that word, okay? We're not going to abuse that word. Here we go. Weaver of Harmony. Go on, baby. Go on with your bad self. Ooh, that just looks good. It doesn't even look like it's going to, like, curl up. Just yet. So that's cool. Boom! Up in them guts! Chandra, what is up, you sexy fire crotch? I have red hair myself. I can say that. I can say that. Oh, I can say that. To her face. Oh, man. Beautiful. Chandra Nalar. We just called that freaking dope right there. Oh, man. <sighs> Mm -mm. What am I batting? Three for four? We're batting th three three for four. And you know how hard it is to call shit like that? It ain't easy, baby. Three for four. Ooh, look at that guy. Our first art card that at least I'm aware of and took the time to take a look at. And we'll put that right there. Let's we'll see what else. Some big hitters. Some big hitters. That's over a dollar right now, but that's going to change. Uh oh, my son's calling my name. It's okay. My parents got him. They got him. They got this. They got this guy. All right, keep it going. Oh, let's go, baby. Up next. By the way, um, I don't know that Sabrina's going to be appearing in a video anytime soon. She is in the hospital right now. <laughs> Real talk, guys. If you made it as far in this video, um, she she's not. Get, put some more S's in the comments for her. Um, she wants to appear in a couple videos, and I do plan to have her uh, in a couple videos. We did hit more than 50 S's, way more than 50 S's for her to make an appearance, which was really, really cool, you guys. Um, you must want to see her, her, her lovely face. Um, and, uh, we all do. So just not sure what the hell's wrong with her, but man, I'm not going to get into details, but yeah, she did have some, like some symptoms I never seen before. I'm like, what the hell's going on here? You know, like 
you don't look good, babe. Like, I, I'm the one that told her I'm taking you to the hospital. And that's that's what happened. My parents watched Jax for a, a couple hours when I sat in the waiting room with her. And then once she got taken in, I sat there like another 20 minutes with her. And then I ended up leaving because I said, I got to go. I got to go record content, babe. This is the life of a, life of a YouTuber. Got to do this. Ooh, explosive singularity foil. Mythic. Okay. That might be a card to spec on. Because if you throw this up like in a modern burn build, I'm not saying it'd be a great idea. But you could, you know, like, you could kick some ass, man. It could, it could go that way. It could, it, it, could, it, could, it could go that way. Just saying. I don't, I don't know how well it would fit there. It's not the most expensive card, but it is the least expensive card, I think, in the whole set. But mostly because it's got that 10 converted mana cost. But don't let that mana cost fool you, though. Uh, that can be put to good use because maybe you could cheapen the Madden cost by tapping. Uh, that's over. That, that's over like 240 right now, something like that. It's a nice little pool. Uh, ooh, another mythic. Life's origin. We will take it. Pretty little freaking shrine there. Some people are getting pissed I wasn't flipping over the cards, but, you know, such is life. I don't, I don't think I ever flip over cards much. Blood Rites. Sacrifice a creature. Blood Rites deals to damage target creature or player. There you go. You sack a bunch of creatures. Hey, <laughs> Throw, throw like two copies of this in the build. Throw like four copies of other things. You might have a deck. Now, probably wouldn't work out too well, but you could try at least, you know. Anyway. So, yeah. Uh, S is in the comments. I hope Sabrina Ninja Gaiden right there. I hope Sabrina, um, you know, has a, has a good little speedy recovery. And uh, I know she just loves to hear when I talk about her in a video. If I don't talk about her in a video, she gets pissed. Three showcase cards in a row. First time I saw that guy. There's a lot of firsts in this video. That was pretty cool. That was really cool. March of Burgeoning. Card sucks balls. Uh, you heard it here first. Maybe second. Maybe third. But you heard it. All right. Moving along. Everyone's like, No, man, it's so good, man. It's freaking you. Some, some, some Xenokex, man. It's freaking you. It's replacing it. I'm out of here. No. No. Stop thinking that way. You're clouding your judgment. Okay? That's a nice looking card though. Cloud Steel Current. Very cool art. Reckoner of the old Bank Buster. And Invigorating Hot Spring Foil. All up in them guts. Nice hit there. That's one of the more sought after uncommons. And we pulled it in a foil, nonetheless. And that felt really good, actually. But yeah, Sabrina does like appearing in videos a lot, so let's all give her a little a little warm S in the comments. If this is the third time you're hearing me ask you to, to give that S, it's probably because it would it would make her day. I'm just saying. It would make her day, so. Tales of Man, you have no clue. She looks at the comments more than I do. I'm not kidding with you. Mostly probably to see if there's some chicks hitting on me. But I'm telling you, that never happens anyway. So I don't know what the hell she's worried about. Spirit Sisters call Bada Skadoosh Bags and Iron Hoof Boar. Uh, no, she checks out the comment section just because she likes hearing what people are talking about. And then they, if she catches something that, you know, I don't, uh, she alerts me. She lets me know about it. Like, hey, man, this person said this. You know, like, what's up with that? You know, like, I, I can, like, she, she's trying to help. So it's really cool of her that she does that. So, graft, graft, craft, greater, GGG. All right, that was a GG right there. Okay, come on. Big hits, big hits. Farewell. Solid card right there. Solid wiper. Who Still can't get enough of these foil showcase cards. All right. I think we're due for a list pull here pretty soon. I'd say in the next couple packs, we're going to hit something juicy. Ooh, a nice little blueage. Nothing too juicy because we just pulled Chandra Lenar. Uh, so you can't really do much better than that. Three of these showcase cards again. Maybe that is normal. Invigorating Hot Springs, another solid hit. Wow, good pack so far. Got some nice solid value, very playable. Ogre Head Helm, got a little weak there. That's okay. And the old Sentinel. Nothing nutso there. Got about nine packs to crack. Nine packs to crack, Jack. Whoo, I want that one with the artist signature on it. That card looks dope. All right, nice art there. And we got one, two. We got just two there. Okay. Okay, okay. Claws of oh, it's not bad. Lion Sash, dude. We got the Lion Sash. If you say that really fast, sounds like Lion's ass. I know, it's nuts. And Okiba Reckoner Raid Foil. There you go. With a list card, of course, because we said there's going to be a list card here. Invisible Stalker with the Hexproof, and it's unblockable. 
that thing can be really annoying. <laughs> it can close out games. Uh, it should be over a dollar. I don't see why it wouldn't be. It's a two drop. That's a that's a great card, man. <laughs> you just pump that sucker up. Take him to Pound Town, bros. Take him to Pound Town. All right, here we go. Big money, honey. We're going to go out with a nice little bang. I already know it. Restoration of a ganjo. Okay. And walking skyscraper foil. Nightmare. Oh, wow. I did not see that one coming. Absolute bulk shit. But still, nonetheless, it's cool to see. Okay. All right, here we go. Here we go. If you do enjoy the videos, you know, my stupid personality, you know. What kind of signature is that? Can we be honest here? What the hell signature is that, man? Even even this little uh, fella here wants to know. What are you doing? Give us an answer. Okay. Yeah, don't do that. Like, the, the artist was too lazy to sign. They're, they're, wait, they're, no, they're too cool to sign? You're too cool to sign a card? Really? I can understand if an artist has no arms or something like that. Use your mouth, okay? Margin of Towering Might. Don't be a dick. I'm totally kidding. Oh, my God. Oh my god, I know some of you are like your freaking mouth just dropped right there. Invoke the Ancients Harmonious Emergence. That was that was a joke, guys. That was a joke, just like where I put that invisible stalker. Oh man. We have fun. We have fun hot dogs. That was one of those cards, by the way. Right there, the commander cards. Alright, we are down to about eight packs. We're down to about nine packs. <laughs> we have fun, huh? Okay. Alright, big hit. Let's go, man. Let's get something fired up. Thundering Ryu. Ryu, guess Raju, whatever. Thundering Raju. And careful cultivation. No big hit. Swing and a miss. That's all right. That's okay. Okay. Swampage. Renegade, you guy. Come on, baby. Let's get something cute here. Something cute. That's cute. Listen to Cool Little Land. Two Heavens is one. Nice card. That, 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 no complaints there, man. And Kami Restless Shadows with Dungeon Shade. This is a thumbnail I used uh, right here. Just like some of the more scarier art from Magic the Gathering's history. I think you could find... I, don't, I think that video is on Bad Boy Gaming Channel. I believe so. Uh, you can go find it. Check it out. Really freaking cool video. I tell ghost stories. I know what? I'll leave it at the end of this video. That could have went in that pile, though. I will leave that at the end of this video. Uh, I tell a bunch of crazy, true... Personal encounter ghost tales. <laughs> Some of this shit, man, gives me goosebumps to this day. Like, I, those, those are freckles. Okay, sorry, I'm stupid. Um, but like to this day, uh, it, it makes me, it makes me freaking. It, it just runs chills down my spine, man. Tamil safekeeping, containment construct. Wow, nice little pack there. The modern age, march of reckless joy. With Invoke the Winds. Not bad. There you go. You have to. If you pull Invoke the Winds, you got to make a 10-year-old fart sound out your mouth. All right? Do it right in front of your mom or girlfriend. All right? They'll appreciate you. Here we go. And make sure it's at the dinner table. All right? Just after your pop's washed up. Here we go. Here we go. Let's go. Let's go. Ooh. Towering Might. Pulled you again. Second time. Invoke Despair. And Master's Rebuke Foil. All right, for real, we have five packs left to crack. Come on, baby. What do we got? Five packs to go. Shink. One, two, three. Book of Mushrooms. Something juicy. Can I do that? March of Wretch Sorrow. Pulled that foil the other day. Not bad. Oh, and Reality Architect. So double rare pack. Double rare pack with a Prosperous Thief, which is not a bad, uh, bad little card to hit. Not bad at all. Whoops. I dropped my old stuff. Dropped my filibuster. Come on, baby. Come on. I don't even know if I got to pick Sabrina up right now. She's probably trying to call. I'm in airplane mode. Whoopsie doodle. All right. Azu, Jungle, Unstoppable. That was our uh, mythic right there. We was almost went right past it. Very nice little mythic. Not really. One of the least des uh, desirable of the, of, the, of the crew. I know. It's crazy. Three packs left. I feel like I zipped through this, but did I really? <laughs> The, you're 34 minutes in. Like, you'd think I went through this quick. No, <laughs> I really didn't. Invigorating Hot Spring. I mean, if I'm pointing out the uncommon value. We didn't go through it that quick. If you haven't seen the, the, the freaking pre-release kit opening, please go watch it 
and just fast forward to 25 minutes into the video, or tw I'd say 24 minutes into the video, you have to get the whole story behind it. Maybe 23, 23, 24 minutes. Go watch that video. You will shit yourself. That was a nice freaking little hit there, man. Wandering Emperor going out with a bang. That's going to be our big hit uh, without a freaking doubt to close this one out. Two packs left. We're not going to see another Mythic. I'm calling it right now. It's not going to happen. I already know this. Here we go. Down to the nitty gritty. That'd be cool if we do. Cloud Steel Curran shows up with the General. Anyone have general insurance? The, the general? For well, free insurance, you can get it online. Call him, 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 save some time. Uh, something like that, right? Uh, there we go. I like this dude's signature. Pretty cool. That is artwork. Very nice. So we got three artists' uh, signatures this uh, this opening. Pretty cool. Uh, Grim Betrayer. None of them worth a damn because they're just lasered on. They're not actual signatures, which is really disappointing. I hope Wizards changes that. And we got Grease Fang. Uh, that was another one of those commander inserts with air of ancient bang that closes it out. Ooh, doggy. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen, for watching this one. It means a lot. Um, drop a comment, show some love if you made it this far in the video. I appreciate it. Tell me you're a dungeon shade. Skaloosh.